What is up guys, welcome back to another episode of Control. Last episode, we started the game off and we learned a bunch of stuff about epic altered world events and objects of something. OOPs, I think it was. Yeah, very interesting. And I'm, oh my god, this music is really, really loomy. Anyways, yeah. Um, so yeah, we're gonna continue game and see if we are exactly where we left off. We should be, if you ask me. Because I'm fairly sure we were at a checkpoint when we last, um, finished. So um, yeah, let's go on and see where this adventure leaves us. Leads us. Leaves? Leads. Leads us, yes. Man, this music is so ominous. So far, I quite enjoy the game. Fast travel? Ooh. I'm so confused. Oh, I can teleport nowadays. Yo, that's pretty cool. Right, Emily Poe. Yes, yes. So we are exactly where we left off. Um, alright. Um, alright, everything's in order. Let's go. Still think everything's a little bit loud though. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. Bruh. I told you to call me Jesse and you still call me Director. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. Man, long time. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones. And before my time. What? And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. Is he the dead one? I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. Or a few of us. And Director Trench would know. Oh, he said. Trench. The ghost, or whatever he is, he mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun, an old Bakelite telephone, a direct line of communication between the director and the board. Oh, right, the triangle. I can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Lovely. Where is the hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mail room. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. So he's probably Keep dead. Lovely. So we're gonna have to fight him as a zombie, don't we? They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. That's the telephone. I know this is all new to you, so 
Don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. Very cool. Right. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Follow the signs to the mail room. You can get to the hotline containment chamber through there. Good luck, Jesse. See right. you back here once you have the hotline. Thanks, Emily. The hotline should be in the communications department. Right. Oh, we can ask stuff. Yo, let's go. Please tell me we don't already know this, though. Where did the hiss come from? I'm not sure. You said the hiss was here when you entered. Did you see anything like that outside before you came in? No. No, just inside. That sounds like a lie. The source is internal, then. See, the oldest house is a sprawling complex with openings to other places as well. I don't even know where to start looking. But in the context, it's good news. The lockdown holds. The his escaping the building would be the end. Pretty shitty world out there if you ask me, but I wouldn't want the his to destroy it. I'm with you on that, Emily. Hmm. You mentioned the oldest house. What is it? This building, the bureau headquarters, the oldest house, is a shifting place. I, you've seen it. It transcends its physical limits. I've been to New York a few times. How didn't I notice this place? It's an attribute of the building. This is a place of power. The oldest house doesn't like attention, so unless you're purposely trying to find it, you don't, which is perfect for us. The work we do here is essential, but unstable. The Bureau prefers not to be noticed. And we need strong walls to make sure nothing gets out. So without you, I never would have found the front door. Okay. Hmm. This trench guy. I keep hearing him in my head. Is he a ghost? Haunting me? I doubt we're talking about a ghost in the traditional sense, but an echo may be. See, if he was killed by the service weapon, your gun, maybe it's his final thoughts recorded by the bullet in his brain, like a, a deep space probe sending back data. But that's just a hypothesis on my part. I need the gun to research it. But you better hold on to that given the circumstances. I think I will. Yeah. All right. Objects of power. Can you tell me what an object of power is exactly? This is all, well, new to me. <laughs> Don't worry, I love going over the basics. So objects of power are mundane objects that house paranatural energies and have developed a link to the astral plane and can thus be controlled, which is what differentiates them from altered items, which are still housings of paranatural forces, but are more volatile and cannot be bound in the peri-utilitarian sense. Bruh. Got it? Did she memorize this? <laughs> Got it. Oh Thanks. my god. Bruh. So HRA stop you from becoming Hiss? Well, it seems that way. I mean, I hadn't even heard of an HRA until a few weeks ago when Dr. Darling started handing them out. Well, I began analyzing mine as soon as I got it. I mean, each one seems to emit a powerful short-range frequency way beyond anything I've ever seen. Doesn't the timing seem suspicious? I thought that too. Dr. Darling usually likes to unveil his latest breakthrough in big presentations. With these, he just passed them out. Yeah, his behavior makes me wonder what exactly he knew. Seems pretty sus. Right then, let's Thanks, exit. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just let me know. All right. Let's go to the hotline. Is it leading me where to go or am I just blind? Communications department. Yep, no idea where that is. Let's go. Oh, there's a sign. How convenient. Yep, it's here. Oh, why does it look like this? There it is again. A welcome message. The heck is this? Hmm. 
Mm, still don't have a clearings card. Oh boy. Can't be worried about these guys. I'm just gonna chill. Bro, I keep doing that. What the hell is this? Oh right, they're like mods. Oh no, why? Oh, I hate this gun. This gun is so bad. Damn it, why? Right, I think we're clear. Ah, there it is. Ah, just lovely. I can't go for... why? No, not again. This is not enjoyable. My god. Man, I'm bad. Am I that bad at shooting, bro? Didn't think they'd be actually clever enough to walk up here. Is that it? Oh, there's one down there. Yep, I see that one. Bro. Man, why is this entire place haunted? Come on now, why? Oh, why is there more coming from over there?
Wait, I can walk here? Bro, why didn't I know that? Right, now I'm blind. Ah, uh, finally. I don't like how creepy it is. This. I'm gonna get jump scared so badly. I'm telling you. You'd think these people would actually know how to, you know, keep their place not be completely stupid. Just look at it. Eight inches wide and capable of storing a whopping 80 kilobytes. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Stolen by our friends at the CIA, the disc held the launch codes to Soviet nukes. Oh, that's Darling. Oh. Uh, this is not the disc, of course, but one exactly like it. A perfect fusion of concepts vibrating in the Cold War era collective unconscious. A receptacle. It is a receptacle for dangerous energies to hone in on. And they did. We don't have the details, but when things started flying around the disk, it was transferred to us. It's an object of power. OOP. Oops. Oh, and it can launch things telekinetically through the air. Bruh. Uh, to date, we, we've launched maybe three dozen pencils. And once, we even launched a cup. Well done. Well done, you big man. Communications. We're on the right track. Wait, we're already in commu- No, I'm not done exploring yet. Come on, then. Oh, wait, am I done exploring? Oh, that's where it came from. Oh, yeah, we're totally done exploring. Come on, then. Man, why doesn't the bathroom have anything to offer us? Whoa. Alright, let's go up the stairs. I don't want to be approaching some alive people right now. Alright, you know what? Let's let's take inventory first. All right, so got more weapon mods. It seems like boost. Wait, what? This one is the exact same thing. Oh wait, no, this is less recoil. Yeah, no, I don't care about that. Personal mods. What's this? Energy boost. Um, energy recovery speed. What, is that health or energy? Health, aha, health. Health recovery. Ooh. Um, yeah, health recovery is better, if you ask me. Right. Unknown caller. To, they hope you can provide insight to his invasion. Cool. Research and records, yes. His barrier. Physical that is difficult to define. Impede escape or access. Destroy the multiple concentrated resonance sources. Destroy the his entities in the area. So I'm guessing if we want to get in, we have to kill all the hisses, I think. The only person you should fail is yourself. Now that is weird. No one says that, come on now. Travel costs. Um, accommodation, money, money, money. 
Uh, hmm. Dead letter approval. Um, cataloging. Allow us to preserve these windows into authentic human encounters. Ooh. Interesting. And then this we've seen, right? Yeah, and Machine God built the thing I saw in my dream. A machine that will contain God, but not the go God you know, or the ones and ones know. A new God, this one machine will be his body, new heart, and blah, blah, blah. Said he would learn how on his own. This is, this is a beginner's body. Hmm, that's kind of sus. Looks like he created, um, he created the, um, his or something. Don't know. So I'm assuming we can't go through there, I guess. Yeah, that door ain't open, opening. Even though I'm getting rid of the hisses. Guess we're gonna have to go through here. Oh look, that body's still there. Um. An object of power. Looks like the hiss have latched onto it. We need to cleanse it. Excuse me. I can't shoot that thing. Lovely. Damn it. Sometimes I just wish you can solve every problem with guns. Reach the object of power to cleanse it. It just wants me to walk up to the thing that's trying to kill me. Let's go. Jesse, you better know what the hell you're doing. Running at the flippin'. I'm gonna go up the stairs and pretend like none of this ever happened. Yeah, I can't shoot that thing. How's they shooting me? It doesn't even see me. Come on then. There we go. Oh, that's a floppy disk. Nuke. It is not a nuke. It's harder to hear you when I'm here. It's like the channel's been changed. The board's in charge here. Their pyramids in the bureau seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? Oh, we're back here. I'm not their director. I'm no one's director. Hold E. Whoa, look at that. Jeez. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Oh, it's charging. Damn it. Oh, damn it. I keep clicking too fast. Damn it. 
Bro. You sure I can't just walk around? Oh my god, I'm not even... Bro. I don't know where to aim. Bro, this is hard. It's not telling me to aim there anymore. Can I... Can I just walk past? <gasps> Wait, I can align myself with it, can't I? Bro. Wait, it's already there. Oh, already did it. That 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 explains why there's a platform here and and why it's not fitting in. Oh my god, I'm dumb. And I have some stuff to throw at them. fight them again just like you wanted right this will help me fight the hiss why is there a flying I'm scared Definitely helped my abysmal aim. Yeah, my aim is pretty bad. I am supposed to kill that thing, right? Bro. Stupid immortal flying red things. Bro. Bro, stop hiding behind that thing. Oh. How did I not see this guy? Said that the hotline can be reached through the mail room. 
See, that's all very intriguing, but where's the mailroom? Oh, oh, there's there's a literal sign saying where the mailroom is, right. Oh, we finally got the clearance, let's go. Oh, I can use these things to travel, oh, that's cool. Oh, bathrooms. Oh, there's nothing in bathrooms. We know that already. Oh, that's a shelter thing from earlier, isn't it? No way. Okay, that, that's just dumb. Wait, why have I locked myself in here? Oh, that's, that's dumb. Damn it, I can't tell if things are, um, telekinesis things or, or just stuff that I can- Oh boy, why is there hanging people again? Okay, shut up. I should have that now, right? Yeah, I do have it. Okay. Oh. Mail room. Mail room. Did I miss it? Aha. Uh -huh. Please don't. Oh no. It's a boss fight. Of course it is. They can fly now. Great. Oh, frick. I don't like this. Um, oh boy. Why is there so many people? Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Here we go. Can't be an end of an of, of a control episode without me dying multiple times trying to end the boss fight, right? Bruh. Bro, again.
the hell? Damn it! I thought I killed it! Oh, great. Now he's just gone. I have a feeling he'll be back. Ah, uh, you think? Oh boy. Let's stay focused. The hotline should be past the mailroom. On this end, you mean? Ah, hotline chamber. Alright, I think this will be the end. I mean, right after we see the epic... Um... Epic mail chamber, right? Wait, we just came back out here. Oh, it's up here? Yeah, it's totally here. I'm so confused. I'm guessing I shouldn't go there next time. Alright. Um, where did the sign lead me though? I'm a bit confused by the hotline chamber sign. Hotline chamber, right, 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 right. No, wrong way. Mail room, and then it should lead us to the hotline chamber somewhere. Pneumatics is upstairs. No, upstairs is where it died painfully. Maybe at the end of the hallway. Oh no, not you again. Go away. Don't like you. No. So I have to enter the mail room. Which is here. Yes, and that's the stair. That supposedly leads me to the hotline chamber, right? One chamber is this way. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, that's, this makes sense. Alright, take this down. The situation in Cuba has been evaluated by the relevant authorities. The mysterious illness affecting the staff at the U.S. Embassy in Havana was caused by sonic weaponry in the hands of a foreign power. Nice. Numerous personnel have damage to the inner ear, but most are expected to make a full recovery. Of course, the event also damaged their cellular walls, but we can't blame that on some stupid noise gun. <laughs> Thank God no local doctors examined them first. Honestly, with the odds an altered item would show up inside a U.S. Embassy. Talk about good luck, huh? <laughs> so much easier to... Hey, are you still recording this? Lovely. Okay. Alberto Tomasi, head of comms. I has got him. Yeah, you think? Here we go. The hotline can't be far now. Cool. Right. Um. Hmm.
Oh, I'm back here again. Great. Right, next time, I'm not gonna do that, okay? Where are we going? Yeah, we have to go to the mailroom first. Alright, next time I won't drop into a pit, okay? Maybe. Why can't I just chill normally without having things going after me, man? Leave me alone. Yeah, I'd be breathing hard too if this keeps happening again and again. Oh, it does say stand here. Mind the gap, bro. What? Have you been here before? What? No. I've stayed at a lot of roadside motels. Oops, sorry. Motels across the country, on the road, on the run, under the radar. This feels like all of them, like something recognized from a dream. Hello? Anyone here? You're telling me none of these things work. I'm so confused. Huh? What? Oh. And of course it doesn't unlock the door in the end of the hallway. Yeah, it's this room, isn't it? Isn't that literally me on the bridge? Oh, finally. <laughs> Another challenge, bro. Alright then, fine. After this challenge, it'll be it, okay? Okay.
Here we go. Another challenge. Lovely. I've always wanted to contact extra dimensional entities. Alright, guess I'm not doing that anymore, hey? Uh, why is it moving? Why is it moving? Why is it moving? Can I even kill it? Bro, what is this? Do I have to pog through it, really? Never had to pog through the monsters before, when you're literally dead. Please let this be it. Don't make me walk into more stone thingies. It is a phone. It's an object of power. It doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is under the right conditions to other planes of existence as well. A director needs a team. My management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. But things change when you become director. Oh, lovely. I have it. The hotline. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. I need to get back to Emily. Right. Let's go back here. react strongly when I tell them about you. Right. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help. Right. While that happens, yeah, we're gonna call it quits here, right after we check stuff out. Reload efficiency, don't care. Yeah, we're just gonna check stuff out and call it quits, alright? Um, yeah, so now we have to- oh, look at all this stuff. Launch ability by blending, binding with the floppy disk. Um, to, 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 call trench, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Oh my god. Uh, that's a lot of stuff. All right, I'm going to read this off camera, okay? Thank you all very much for watching today's epic control video. And bye-bye.